hello guys welcome to civil concept and in this video we will see how to print this drawing into a three size paper okay so here i have created a different drawing like uh, open terrace uh, ground floor plan and here trench plan after that uh, footing plan etc and elevation etc okay now i want to print all this drawing into uh, a three size paper then how will we uh, do this okay so to print out in a three size paper in one is to hundred scale uh, we have to first of all create a layout okay so here you can see layer to one and layout two and uh, i have already worked on it so uh, i will show you from uh, beginning okay so uh, you have to create a new layout okay so to create a new layout uh, you can see this plus icon at the bottom of this autocad so click here and you will see uh, layout 3 has been created okay so now you are in model you can see here you are in model here this workspace is in a model in model we will create different types of drawing okay now to print out in a3 size paper to set this drawing into a3 size paper you have to go into layout okay so i am clicking on the layout okay so you can see this is the uh, by default paper size and this is the viewport okay so first of all i am deleting this by default viewport so now i have deleted this uh, uh, viewport uh, you can see this is the size of the paper and uh, it is not defined that what is the size of this paper okay so we have to set this size of paper as a, a3 okay so click on the layout right click on the layout 3 and go to the page setup manager okay so click on the page setup manager and select layout 3 okay so layout uh, 3 and go to the modify now in modify you have to select your printer okay so i have brother dcp for now i will show you in pdf form so i will uh, click here drawing to pdf okay now i will select the size of the paper okay so i will be selected here 420 by uh, this 296 7 mm which is a three size paper okay now we have to uh, put here the scale 1 mm equals to 0 0.03937 if your drawing is in feet and inch okay but if your uh, drawing is in mm then mm or meter then you can simply put here 1 okay now my drawing is in feet or inch so i will put here 1 mm equals to 0 0.03937 okay so click here okay okay and close it now our uh, this imaginary line or dotted line has set into a three size paper okay now i am creating a viewport to put the drawing okay so uh, to put the viewport you have to go into layout okay click on the layout you can see a different uh, different uh, menu bar okay so click on the layout and click on the rectangular layout okay so i am creating here two viewport okay so uh, you can uh, put the rectangular viewport within this uh, imaginary line okay so uh, beside this imaginary line outside of this uh, imaginary line you cannot print out okay so printer will printer will not support this uh, anything written outside of this line okay so you have to put the viewport within this uh, dotted or imaginary line okay so i am creating here viewport from this corner to up to here okay because at the bottom of this viewport you will have to write consultancy name stamp your name is scaling etc okay so i have taken a viewport and now to enter into this viewport you have to just double click within this uh, viewport okay so i am clicking double click in this viewport and you will enter into this viewport okay so first of all i will put what uh, floor plan and this uh, open trace plan okay so how will we do it do it uh, just first of all we have to zoom this and set your scale okay so to set the your scale first of all you have to uh, see here at the bottom of this autocad the here is a scaling okay so i am uh, putting here scaling one is 200 okay so this scaling is a little bit large so i will increase the scale one is 220 and again it is a little bit large so i am again changing its scaling to 100 one is 250 okay so here uh, now i can see this scaling is fitting into this viewport okay one is 250 okay so if you want to 
uh, if you want to uh, put this scaling into 1 is to 100 then you have to increase your viewport size okay so but uh, for now i am putting 1 is to 150 now here uh, to come out from this uh, viewport you have to double click outside of this uh, viewport okay so i am double clicking this outside of the viewport and i have came outside of this viewport okay again i am taking another viewport so i am taking again rectangular viewport and i am putting from here to here as a another viewport okay so i have created another viewport and again i am zooming uh, out this and again to enter into this viewport i will double click in it and again i am zooming it okay so i will put this beam plan okay so you can see here this is a our footing plan okay so i will put here footing plan and uh, zoom uh, zoom in and setting it to scale 1 is 200 okay for now so you can see here this 1 is 200 is uh, fitting in this viewport so i will leave it in 1 is 200 uh, scaling okay if it will not uh, set into 1 is 200 then what we have to do we have to increase or decrease the scale and again we have to edit into our this model section in the drawing okay so we have set this in 1 is 200 scale and uh, entering escape i will uh, leave the command okay again i am clicking outside of this viewport and we will see here uh, this both viewport has been created okay now uh, guys i want to print out this uh, drawing okay so first of all i will select all uh, like this and uh, give the command p l o t enter okay so you have to select here your uh, what your um, printer so i am just showing you pro preview so i am uh, clicking your drawing to pdf okay and this uh, paper size will automatically set you don't have to do anything okay and now i am previewing it so you can see here this is our drawing and uh, it has been created in the a3 size paper and uh, uh, here at the bottom of this uh, a3 size paper you have to create your stamp your name your uh, consultancy name scaling etc okay so guys in this way we can print out our drawing into a3 size paper okay so please like this video and subscribe my channel for new update about civil engineering thank you